Let's play Kokoto Platform Jumper Part 3. Fuck off, bitch. Um, I'll warn you now, I'm in a really bad mood today, so I'll probably be throwing at Kokoto more than I usually would. More than anyone usually would. Because no one can play a Kokoto game without shouting at him um, at least a million times. Someone in um, on the comments for Part 2 said that I swore I said the F word um, more than... Scarface in that in the last part. I don't know if that's true. If it is true, I feel impressed with myself. And it didn't launch me up into that little thing's ass. It wanted to though. Is it promoting homosexual tendencies? Who knows? I have nothing against homosexual tendencies. I'm just wondering if Neko Entertainment is trying to and it's launched onto the fire which I can't get. Well done. Uh anyway, yeah. What was I gonna say? Fuck you bitch. Um uh, what I needed. Uh, it, how the hell am I meant to miss that little stupid salad fingers look alike? Or at least. And again! Twice! Fuck you, bitch! I fucking hate you! Anyways, um. So, through most of this, I'll probably be calling Kokoto a little red cunt. Um, thank you, whoever said that in one of the parts. Um, unfortunately, being the high. FUCKING HELL! I'm gonna punch someone soon! <sighs> FUCK YOU! Oh, I've got three continues, have I? So hang on, does that... Do they respawn? Every time you start it? Who knows? What was I saying? Oh yeah, that was it. I was gonna make some arrogant... way. It's gonna kill me! It makes some arrogant thing about how... Seeing as I'm some... HIGH oh, FUCKING HELL! Some... Some highly rated popular LP that I'm not going to remember, little people. I'm sorry, I have a very bad memory for name. I have a very bad name memory for names. I have a very good name when it comes to codes, which helped with this. I can build it over that. Good. I can tell you it now. It's T T A T T A L T T A L T D O L. Check that on part. Two and you will see that I'm right. I think that launched me into the arse of that thing. Fucking whoa! It's, it spawned me on top of salad fingers. How the hell did they get this through at all? I don't understand how they when they finished this game, they they made it and they gone. All right, yep, that's that's a good game. I like it. Yep, put that in the shops. Why they, why they didn't just go, burn it, and the people that made it, and their families. Okay, so this is where I went before. Fuck you. Fuck you. Hey, hey, hey. What a weird noise for a creature to make. Yay. Volcano part one done. Three minutes. Um, actually, that brings me nicely on to something. What was I talking about before? I don't know, but it brings me on nicely to... Something, I did some research on the Neko Entertainment website. This is far from entertainment. Tata Lurf Mud 159. Good. Whatever the feck that means. Anyway, yeah. I went on to Neko Entertainment's website uh, to do a little bit of research into, into Neko Entertainment. What the fuck was that? It was just huge. Is it meant to be like that? Or is it, is it that it's glitched like a bitch? Whoa! I thought I'd got him then. That doesn't really make any difference, does it? He certainly got me there. Cunt. Anyway, I went on to Neko Entertainment's uh, website to have a look at um, what they say about their own products. And they openly admit to ripping off other games. I went on to the Kokoto platform, no, Kokoto Kart Racer thing. Um, and it mentioned something about emulating the, the, um, the drift function. From Mario Kart, and then it went on to say, "Hang on, so he's up there. Wait for him to move. I'm not gonna get launched into another bat's ass." Yes, I am. It mentioned about uh, emulating the drift function of Mario Kart, and then went on to use the phrase um, for a budget racing game. It's certainly good, and that so that annoyed me that they openly admit to making budget, poor quality games um, as you can see here uh, um, I don't know if it's me being a shit gamer 
or whether it's the game itself. I was watching back um, part two and watching myself and thinking, oh, bollocking hell, I really am shite. Or whether it's that I'm trying to think too much. Because the problem is I, I keep coming up with ideas to, for things to say. But then what happens is I, have, I want to try and get them out as quickly as possible, otherwise I'll forget them. You know, I'll... I'll and that's why sometimes I, I race ahead of myself, I stop talking about things, I... Um, that's why I sometimes uh, mess up my words because I'm thinking too much about what I'm trying to say. Sorry about that, and an old fuck you, bitch. Didn't say that, did I? I haven't said that for a while. Fuck you. Uh, I said something about the Kakota being a little red cunt, didn't I? Yeah. Um, and uh, actually, quite a few comments have been saying, "See, I'm, I'm rushing ahead of myself." A lot of the comments have been saying, "Why? I thought we'd seen the last of this twat." Unfortunately, not. Um, I think it's glitched and it's now got. Oh, is that? Or is it just big apples are worth five and small ones are worth one? Who knows? Oh, fuck, run away! Whoa, fuck! Ah! That went slightly in my favour, I think. Build those up, build up the fire turds. I've remembered that move since the last one. I. I was watching that back going, whoa, how do I forget it? And I think I mentioned that before, didn't I? I don't know, I've forgotten about the comments. People have been saying, why have you been doing this? I thought we got rid of that cunt. No, he's out there. Unfortunately, Neko Entertainment has somehow got some um, funding. Oh, get back here, you twatting apple. Yeah, I'm still annoyed at the lack of a melee attack. You need some kind of melee spin thing. Actually, I tried recording this before went balls up. Um, so, how can I do this? I think I worked it out and then I forgot it. Oh, no! Oh, okay, double jump. That works. No, it didn't. Okay, it worked. Duh. Past tense. Whoa, there, now I'm up, now I'm sliding. Fuck you, Mr. Grub. Whatever you are that shoots weird things. What are, what are the things that it shoots? Oh yeah, I noticed something that um, it is mirrored. It's not just that the environment is, environment is mirrored. It's that uh, everything you do is mirrored. The fire turd things. If I put that there and went over to the right, it would be mirrored. But I'm not going to do it because I'm on a time limit. I'm s Fuck you! You titted... You boob tube tit... Tiny titted... Fairy devil angel bitch cunt. Um, I, I am sorry for the swearing, and, um, actually, you know, someone was saying about how that they think that most of the entertainment from this LP will be from hearing how annoyed I'm getting. At least you're getting entertained. At least I'm doing my job. <gasps> Big gem! Yay, it gave me 300 points, which is useless. Did you see that? Ah! He skimmed me the fucking... I'm fuck you! How long has that been? Eight minutes. Actually, oddly enough, all this shouting at Kokoto is really making me relax. I've... Oh, it, it's good fun. I like. I'd re I'd recommend Kokoto simply as a um, as a as a way of releasing anger. If there was a Kokoto shout at the little red cunt game, I'd buy that. If they incorporated some kind of Wii microphone into it, um, maybe like you know, like PlayStation SingStar microphone, the Microsoft um lips microphone, some kind of rock band Wii microphone, something like that, where you could just go, Kokoto, you're a cunt. And he goes, ow! And that's his only response. Or, as you know, the Wiimote, you kind of use it as a punching thing. That would be good. Forget, you know, the make it sensitive. You want something on your feet so you can actually kick him as well. That would be, I'd buy that game. T-O-A-L-U-T-D-T-L-160. I'd buy that game. I'd buy, um, punch the little red cunt in the face. I would, I would definitely buy that. I would go out, and I would gladly spend at least five pounds on that game. Maybe just make it we um we download thing. Oh, oh, I really need to get one. I need to get a new telly, and I need to get um a Nintendo Wii. I found some good deals, but uh, ah, it launched me into another fucking enemy and another game over. That's two game overs in um. Mon part. Oh, I haven't had the Spurious Line, have I? It's nearly 10 minutes. Okay. Spurious Line number three. Um. Neko Entertainment. 
uh, is causing global warming. They've actually got huge zeppelins which fly up into the sky and what they do is they go up with pickaxes and actually chip away um, holes in the ozone layer. Just going, fuck your ozone layer! And they kick polar bears in the face and they're actually going up to the North Pole with blow torches. So Neko Entertainment are responsible for global warming. Um, and they rape penguins. It's a shame, isn't it? For legal reasons, I should point out that Neko Entertainment don't kick polar bears in the face or rape penguins. Uh, but we all know that they do, really. They do. Oh, uh, anyway, I should be off now. Because I'm coming up to, to 11 minutes. Um, I'll record another part of Let's Play Pokemon Far Red after this, so I'll see you then. Alright, see you soon. Bye bye.